Hey guys, what's going on and welcome to Resort Originals. Yep, get used to that. So we are in a middle of a rebrand right now and I am super excited for it because it brings something new to the channel that we really haven't had ever. Where we've always had Pokemon Resort or Poke Resort content and it was always Pokemon. I know there's one time maybe in like 2015 where I did like whatever I want Wednesdays but it didn't last very long because everyone's here for Pokemon. So basically I am taking this year as a chance to broaden my horizons as far as content goes. Now Pokemon it will still be here but it will not be the only content from here on out and I think that was my biggest issue from the past couple of years doing YouTube where everything was Pokemon and I think I slowly got burnt out from it and a lot of it did have to do with let's go and I think it was also just doing it for so many years because I mean I've been doing this since the end of 2013 and you can do Pokemon for so long it gets to a point where you've done everything you can do and just doing the same thing over and over again just gets a little repetitive even if it is looking for a new idea as far as like different like not even top tens but different facts or different uh, video styles but in the end it's still Pokemon and when I try to broaden my horizons the channel didn't do so well and I'm at the point where it doesn't really matter anymore because Everyone that was mainly watching my channel, I was more of like a 2015-2016 channel. So ever since then, it's kind of fallen off a little bit. And I take total responsibility because I just didn't want to upload that much anymore. And that cost me tons of viewers. And for those of you who are still here, I appreciate you. But you can also look forward to something new that will be changing to the channel. And because there's going to be new stuff happening, that is going to be the reason why you'll be seeing a lot more content. Now we stick to Pokemon just last year and may I maybe uploaded about five videos. And I don't think that was enough to be able to keep me going as far as a YouTuber goes. So what we're going to be doing this year is I'm also a graphic designer. So as a graphic designer, uh, I want to be able to enhance my abilities for uh, when I get a job. And one of the things people look for in a job is video editing skills. Now, you're like, dude, you've been Edit, editing videos and uploading for like five years like yes yes I have but I have not been doing it on Adobe Premiere Pro and I have not used After Effects so my goal during uh, this next semester and part of this uh, winter break that I'm on right now is to be able to enhance my skills with those abilities so those are th some things that you guys will be seeing me as an individual trying to work on and make it better so videos may not be like consistently every single day or every single week but it'll be something that I'm just trying to make myself uh, more capable as a content creator and as a graphic designer so those are going to be my main goals for this year and um, I'm sure you guys are at the point where um, dude we what are you what are you going to upload and that is going to be what we're going to be going up next so what we're going to be uploading is going to be more the best way to explain it is if you look at my new banner on YouTube where you guys will see you, actually you guys probably already saw the rebrand right now where uh, I wanted to go something more of a pink and blue style something that's a little bit more uh, tropical something more vibrant and I know that everything's kind of going more towards gradients and I'm really liking the style even with this shirt yeah I think I have to like change the angle I mean this isn't the best camera in the world but this goes from like blue to pink maybe if I there we go now you can see it and then let's see see that little palm tree there I mean this is just everything just fits my style so well and I think just making something more professional and I love the logo that I designed for at the same time and for all those people who are still a fan of Pokemon and love my Alolan Raichu logo he's still in there if you look around a little bit I know actually if you see I think it's uh, in this corner right here you'll be able to see the uh, Alolan Raichu icon that still represents the channel because this still is Pokemon related and I don't ever forget want to forget where this all started from so I just feel like I have to give a little bit of a mention to that Alolan Raichu icon and I'm a really big fan of it as well especially in the uh, uh, pink and white color scheme so we got pink white and blue and I'm just uh, I'm just I'm really excited where uh, everything is going to be turning into now my goals for this year are more of just trying to make myself better and just having fun with the channel where in the past it's more of okay what is going to get the most views but will I also enjoy doing it now it's not it like everything as far as trying to get views is out the window it's literally what do I enjoy doing 
that's what I'm gonna upload because I think part of it was a competition back then where I think I peaked like just any any video would be guaranteed to get about 2,000 views and I think it was awesome but then it kind of got tasking because I didn't enjoy doing it as much anymore and I went more of what will be clicked more rather than what am I, I am I enjoying that I'm making and I don't think um, I want to make that mistake again because I've come to the conclusion that this will never be my full-time job um, this will just be something that I enjoy doing as a hobby and I accept that and I am perfectly perfectly okay with that I mean, we've, we've made it to 17 million views on this channel. I'll, I'll gladly take that. I'm very happy with how that uh, ended up turning up. But um, now let's get into... <laughs> I don't know why it's taking me so long to get to this, but you guys want to know what we're making right here, right? You guys want to know what's going to be going on, so I got a little bit of a list of things that will be happening to the channel this year. So, you guys still will be seeing Pokemon videos. That's number one. It may not be periodically, but you can guarantee to ex expect some kind of Pokemon content still to be coming to the channel. So, you got that coming for you. Um, as far as other things than Pokemon goes... Dokkan, uh, if you guys are mobile gaming fans, now the three games that I play right now are Dokkan, Duel Links, and uh, Legends, and Legends is Dragon Ball Legends, Dragon Ball Dokkan, so they're, they are kind of gacha games, Yu-Gi-Oh is a little bit less gacha, it's more of you just have to keep opening the packs till you get everything you want, then you have to do it again so you get three of pretty much every card that you need to be able to make a deck, and I am at the point where I enjoy more the nostalgia part of Duel Links, as far as what the meta is right now and just how everything's going, I have lost a little bit of interest, but the second I start to regain that interest into Duel Links, I'll be more than happy to bring it to the channel and have something fun for you guys to play. So Dokkan, that is going to be something that I will be kind of finicky with as far as summons go. My goal this year is not to spend a lot of money on gacha games, and boy did I spend a lot last year. So if I was going to do Dokkan, it should have been last year. But uh, you guys can be uh, saving, or uh, I guess basically waiting for next week, because I'll be uploading a Dokkan video then. It'll be on the uh, Gogeta and Broly banners, and I have plenty of stones saved up for that, so you guys can look forward to a lot of summons. And that may be kind of close to the end uh, as far as summons go, until summer when we have the, uh, I think it's the four year anniversary, and that's when I'll start to save up again for that. So those are the games that uh, I play mobily right now that you guys may see coming to the channel. Other things are, well, I'm still a Yu-Gi-Oh fan. Uh, maybe I'll bring some older Yu-Gi-Oh games as such as like some PlayStation 1 games or PlayStation 2 games or anything for like maybe Game Boy. We'll see what the graphics are like. It might get a little bit annoying for me if I don't see the clarity of the cards. It doesn't need to be perfect, but just so I kind of know what's going on. I liked more the OG Yu-Gi-Oh than what the future Yu-Gi-Oh is and I think I'll just kind of keep it keep it to that for now so if you enjoy more of the nostalgia uh, aspect of Yu-Gi-Oh like I do then you'll uh, enjoy the content that'll be coming to this part of the channel next thing will be uh I have a capture card for uh pretty much anything that I want so you guys might start start seeing some PlayStation games you might see um more Nintendo games as a broad sense where it's not just Pokemon where um I got uh I have a Nintendo Switch have a PS4, pretty much anything that I want to play on there, I'll be able to bring to the channel. So you guys can uh, just let me know if there's any kind of content that you guys would like to see me bring to the channel. Definitely let me know in the comment section below because I'll be looking at what, what you guys are saying as well. And if I see anything that piques my interest, I'll be more than happy to be able to make a video or two or maybe a series on it. We will see when it comes to that point in time. As far as series go, we will see. We will see. Mainly because I don't know how busy I will be in the spring semester where I'm basically getting everything together I've worked on for the past three years to uh, be ready to present to potential employers and that might take a lot of my time but I know I'll always be able to have time to make a video or two maybe like once a week so I don't think I'll have an issue as far as that goes just more if I turn into a series then I may only be able to upload one series and then move on after that so we'll we'll see when we get to that point but um yeah that's where I'm kind of standing as far as uh series goes I mean they're they're tough to commit to because there's so many videos to be able to do and you have to finish it otherwise it's gonna be kind of pointless if you go halfway through the series and you just stop playing it I don't I don't want to do that to you guys even if it is the channel seems to be more for for me now um other stuff I would still like to bring to the channel are podcasts. I am a big fan of just having conversations with people and on uh, topics that I may like or may not like, and I like to have a little bit of back and forth. So my goal is to maybe have a podcast, maybe once a month, something around there, just so I can have someone to talk to and uh, just talk about whatever I enjoy talking about. And I think that'll just be something fun for me, something for you guys just to tab out on and listen in the background and uh, go from there. Um, so that's kind of it for the podcast. And then another thing that, uh, um, think about bringing to the channel is, uh, movie, movie reviews. 
and I'm a big fan of Marvel, um, just more of an entertainment industry as a whole, more of mainstream or franchises that would be brought to the channel as far as movie reviews go, like um, Into the Spider-Verse, such an amazing musing, uh, <laughs> amusing, uh, such an amazing movie, and I really did enjoy it so much where I would have loved to be able to make a review on it, but it's a little bit late for that now, so I don't think I'll really do that unless the Blu-ray comes out, then I'll give my opinion on what the Blu-ray is, and then I guess anything that, um, that's more related to, um, I'd say, I'd say close to Marvel, uh, Star Wars, that kind of stuff. I'd be more than happy to be able to make a review on that. But as far as anything else goes, probably not. But if I do enjoy it, I would have no problem bringing it to the channel and just having myself talk for a little bit. I can practice my video editing skills and After Effects skills when it comes to those videos. So that's why I plan to do there. Another thing would be more of old school video games. Now, as far as old school goes, something kind of like a Nintendo 64 or something around PS1, PS2. I, I like simpler games. I'm not the the biggest competitive game guy just because I'm not the kind of person that would put hours and hours into a game just to be good at it. I'd rather put 30 hours into a game and just enjoy my entire time through the game and then be done playing it. But competitive it is a little bit different where you basically put 30 hours into the game at least to get comfortable to controls, what the meta is like, uh, just, just understand what the competitive is, and then you go out and you play well at it. So I don't know if that's necessarily my style, and I don't think that will ever really be the style for the channel. And one example is the mobile game Dragon Ball Legends. I enjoy more of doing the PvE rather than the PvP because I don't know, I'm just I'm just not good at <laughs> multiplayer stuff. So um, if you're looking for competitive and learning from me, don't subscribe to this channel. You're you're gonna make a mistake. You're gonna make a mistake subscribing. <laughs> um, but um, other than that, I would say those are the main things for you guys can expect from the channel as far as that goes anything else that like piques my interest i'll be more than happy to let you guys know and go from there um last things maybe some graphic design stuff just because i am a graphic designer i can do some speed arts or showing different uh logos and art that i've made over the years and just be able to show you guys what what uh what my future is going to be so i think that'd be something kind of Cool to show off to you guys as well and do any kind of video edits as far as maybe be making cool animations with logos and stuff so you guys can maybe see what the process is like as I learn it so I think that'll be something maybe that'll come to the channel that's kind of like on the bottom of things that I will uh, prioritize prior, prior, bleh, prioritize and uh, last 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 thing I don't know if I'm gonna do it but uh, do I even say it do I say it I'll just say it. <laughs> uh, I, I'm a big shoe fan. I, I love shoes. I don't know if this is necessarily the platform to do it. Even if I enjoy shoes and I think it's still more for me, I just don't know if combining gaming with shoes is something that's even really possible. I don't think so as much as I would like it to be. It may not be the platform, and especially uh, the other thing would be sports. So maybe I'll make another channel that will be revolved more around sports and shoes. And that will get to a different niche market than what I currently have right here or that I will be growing throughout this year. So I think those are the main things that I wanted to discuss today. So I hope you guys are enjoying or are excited for what is going to be happening with the channel going forward and I know I'm really excited just because you guys will be seeing uploads more often. Whether you want to watch the video or not, you'll know that I'm being active on YouTube and I think that's all that really matters for me this year. Just being able to upload content and be working hard at something that I want to learn at the same time and I think that's good for anyone. Where find something that you enjoy doing, learn how to do it better and then keep practicing it so you can become a master at it eventually. Everyone wants to be a master, especially if you're a Pokemon fan, gotta be a Pokemon master, and that will never be forgotten from the channel. So if you're worried about losing Pokemon content, don't be. It will still be coming, just not as frequently, and you guys can enjoy other stuff that may come to the channel. So thank you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I, everything that's led up to this point, it's all thanks to you guys. I appreciate it so much. I mean, 17 million views. We've had over 40,000 subscribers, and when I started this channel, I knew I had the ability to be successful on the platform. One thing I didn't know was how long I could make it for, and if I was able to keep it up. And that was one thing that I wasn't able to do, but I know if I work hard and I'm consistent at it, I know I can be successful on this platform because 
I just believe in myself, whether it's on here or other, other areas, I just think it's important to be confident in whatever you do, whether even if you're not good at it, because if you can be confident in knowing that you're doing your best to get better, I know you'll be feeling good about yourself in the end. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. I think that is it for me uh, babbling on, on and on and on and on like what I'm doing right now. Um, as far as intros and outros go, you guys will be seeing them closer, uh, maybe like next week or going further for uh, videos when it officially kicks off for the channel. This is kind of like the transition period right now. So once we get past that point, you guys will start to see more of the branding around the channel as far as in the video goes. As of right now, you guys can see my new channel logo, which I really hope you guys like. The new channel banner, you guys can see uh, the new channel name. And once again, Resort Originals. That's why I decided to go with. I wanted to keep the, the name Resort in there, but I also didn't want to just keep it at Resort because it's it's almost like too broad. So I thought it was Resort Originals is something that I can bring to the channel that I'm making. It's original content, and I am more than happy to uh, do something like that. So I'm pretty happy with how it's all turned out. So let me know if you like the logo, like the style, and the branding of the channel. If you don't, let me know what, what things you don't like, what you want to see changed even more, because I'm still working on some things in the background as far as that goes with the channel. So I hope you guys are looking forward to the change and just the total rebrand and just the this is a brand new channel now, so look forward to it, and I will see you guys in the next one. Subscribe if you're interested. I'll see you guys later. Have a good one.